Hi guys, welcome back to GP Reactions. I hope you will. Hope you're having a great day. And as always, thank you for subscribing. Um, I do apologise. I haven't been here for uh, a number of weeks. I've had a really, really bad cold and I'm glad to be back. Uh, my throat has been sort of dragging on for about two, two and a half weeks now. Uh, where it just kind of feels like it's every, every so often it just kind of cracks and I start coughing. Um, it's nothing more serious than a really, really bad cold, but the likes which of which I've never experienced, I don't think ever. I mean, generally a cold can last, you know, a week. I usually get a sore throat, I get a sniffly nose, and then it just kind of drags on. I feel a bit snotty. I mean, I'm fine, but this one um, has literally been the mother of all colds. And um, I do wonder why um, all of a sudden, I, you know, I've had a bad, really bad cold like this, but... Hey, I'm glad to be back and um, really looking forward to, I've been looking forward to actually reacting to these for a couple of weeks now. And this is a track by Steel Eye Span and this is called The Blacksmith. It's taken from the album Hark the Village Wait, uh, which was released in June 1970. And like a lot of the songs, I'm getting the impression that a lot of the songs from Steel Eye Span are, are sort of uh, reinterpretations of old folk songs and for sure this looks like it could be another one of those. Um, I'm really kind of like falling in love with Maddie Pryor's voice. She's got this wonderful, I wouldn't say haunting because haunting would make it sound like quite a little bit depressing but um, she feels like she's off the earth when she sings. Um, so yeah, um, Still Ice Band consists of Maddie Pryor on lead vocals uh, Gay Woods on backing vocals, Terry Woods on mandala. Is that like a mandolin? Mandala. Um, Tim Hart on electric guitar, Ashley Hutchings on bass, and Jerry Conway on drums. Um, without further ado, I'm really looking forward to this. Um, I feel like this will be a really maybe chilled out song. I'm all already envisaging what her voice is going to sound like. So, yeah, um, this is. It looks like this is taken from a radio session with, I'm guessing, John Peel. Um, I had a quick look at the comments and they seem really, really favourable to this particular um, version, um, but it's not the album version. So um, forgive me if I need to hear the album version, then I'll, obviously I might go back and just have a private listen to that. Um, so yeah, I'm going to go with this one and uh, see what see what it's about. Let me just tie that bracket. Um... Okay.
that was uh, Steel Ice Band with the Blacksmith, the Jump Hill Sessions, and um, that was that was absolutely beautiful. Um, and one of the things that kind of struck me towards the end of this song was that you hear a lot of um, songs where the where the music carries is the vehicle for the lyrics, or where the uh, lyrics um, are just I don't know, sort of um, an aside to the music. So music's more important where one is more important than the other. But with this track, I really kind of felt that um, very toward towards the end, I felt that I could probably listen to four minutes uh, or so of the music, and I could listen to four minutes of just the singing. But when you kind of put them together, it was magical. And uh, the the thing I loved about the music was the I believe I'm, I'm guessing a mandolas, a a form of stringed instrument and the electric guitar and the bass. They were so gentle, um, but then they kind of combined to to make this beautiful tone of, that takes us through the song, and it does feels it feels like the the strings like meander uh, through the song, uh, like 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 maybe a small brook running through a village. And it did, did it did set the scene for the the drama of a small village, but also that gentleness. It just kind of lulled me into that kind of peaceful tranquility. Um, but then the story of the song, I I got the feeling there's a little bit of drama going on there. Um, and again, Maddie Pryor's voice was so in tune with the instruments that it felt very really organic. Um, uh, so yeah, I mean. Uh, I, I kind of gathered what was going on in the first verse. A blacksmith courted me nine months or better. Um, and I feel that the nine months bit is a suggestion that maybe she is with child, possibly, um, or she's um, pregnant and she's waiting to give birth. Um, he fairly, when my heart wrote me a letter, so he's, he's actually moved away from her. So maybe she was pregnant when they were together. With his hammer in his hand, he looked so clever. And if I were with my love, I would live forever. Oh, where's my love gone? His cheeks like roses. He's gone across the sea gathering primroses. I'm afraid the shining sun might burn and scorch his beauty. And if I were with my love, I would do my duty. Strange news is a come to town. Strange news is carried. Strange news flies up and down that my love is married. Oh, I wish them both great joy, though they don't hear me. And if I were with my love, I would do my duty. What you promised me when you lay beside me, you said you'd marry me, not deny me. If I said I'd marry you, t'was only to try you. So bring your witness, love, and I'll not deny you. So there you go. I mean, it's a fairly straightforward uh, tale of a guy with a with a girl and he's got her up the duff if you like um but he's moved away he's seen the opportunity to move away perhaps he didn't want that responsibility um and he's now writing back to the village that he's married somebody else that he's found so it's a little bit sad but so life continues just as life continues in the, that village yeah it's such a lovely lovely song um, I just love the subtle textures of the guitars. It really, really kind of stood out for me. I didn't really hear the drums so much, but um, I'm not sure if there were any drums on this. Maybe I just, I was just so absorbed with his singing and the guitars that um, probably completely overlooked the drums. Anyway, guys, let me know what you think about this song. Uh, join me in the comments below. Until next time, take care of yourselves. And I'll speak to you soon.